Good morning, this is Daniel Frenchos with Marine Max Orlando, and today I'm showcasing this all new and available Boston Whaler 325 Conquest. This is the 2023 version, we just got it in, and it is awesome. You have the white hole sides with the chrome graphics and the silver stripe down the side. Uh, nice big bow rail up there, and then of course you've got a, a windlass up top. I see this boat is on a trailer here, it's in our showroom in Orlando, but you, it's just huge. Great boat, you can do anything with a uh, mini sport fish uh, to say the least. This boat does have the twin 400 white V10 Mercury's. Awesome power to the option of this boat. And you'll see you've got a lot of different things back here. There's a lot of boat, uh, so we have a little bit of time, but you'll be able to come in and check it out. They've got your trim tabs, your underwater lighting. This is gonna be your transducer here. And then you'll see you've got big cleats on the back and the pop-up and everything like that. Your um, shore power hookup in the back there. And then these boats, uh, they'll come standard with the joystick piloting and it's, it's just unbelievable for the size of this boat, how easy you can control it. But we'll go up here and check out the, the swim platform here. And it's really nice to be able to actually walk across the back. The motors are down right now, but even when they're up, you can walk across the back. You can service these motors and do anything you'd like. It just makes it really, really nice to be able to do everything from up top. And then of course, you know, swimming at the sandbar, you can come up here, you got a walk through transom door, and then you'll see just straight ahead, uh, you've got the nice sure shade that comes out, you get the nice spreaders that are pointing right at you as well. So just imagine this at night, you get the nice blue lighting in here and then all the, the lights and switches and everything that you want. Uh, first things first, back here, we've got a nice pull-out couch. So it's big, heavy-duty stainless steel. It's, you can fit three or four people here easily. And then you'll have your, uh, your teak table that is stored underneath the bilge area here. I'll show you in a second. It'll go right in the middle. And then you can have you know, your entertaining and uh, cook that fish that you caught for the day. Speaking of fishing, you've got uh, rod holders all across the back, down the sides, and then in the uh, hard top here, as well as this boat is already equipped with the outriggers, so it's ready to go fishing, and I'd love to take you out. So with the whalers, completely foam filled, basically a Yeti cooler with a motor on the back, and you have fish boxes each side with the macerator pumps in there, and then this one's so new, we haven't even got the props on it yet, so you'll have big stainless steel props there. And then just looking at the uh, the bilge here, you can actually get to every single uh, component, batteries, and uh, pumps that you need. Very nice and neat. Plenty of batteries, plenty of switches. you got your generator, and this one's actually equipped with the Sea Keeper as well. So when you're going offshore, you're not going to be bounce, uh, uh, bouncing and weaving. And uh, if anybody gets seasick, it's a great option to have. But here's your teak table that will go right on the other side. It's gas uh, assisted, so it's easy to put up, put down as well. It doesn't slam either, so it's very nice to be able to do that. And then here you have dive door here. So you push in this button. It's big, heavy duty. It's an actual cutout of it. So you can put this in. It'll hold right there. And then you have your dive ladder uh, stored away where it needs to be. Clip it in, and then you could dive on and off or just go into the sandbar. It's nice to be able to uh, have a nice big ladder. And then you can easily shut that and lock it in place. You'll see that you have steps up on the side with the non-skid as well. So you can easily get to the bow of the boat. Or if you have a uh, dock that's a different height, you have the non-skid up here that's really nice. And you'll see here, big old cleat, but also there's a little channel right there. So in case it does rain and you're keeping the boat in the water, the water will just run right off. It won't come back here in, in your uh, cockpit area and get it all dirty. But uh, this is just a, a quick look back here. Now we're gonna go towards the helm and there's just so much to go over in such little time, but you've got your nice summer kitchen with the grill here. You can pull that out. Put it back away you're ready to go and then you'll see that this right here is a step you might wonder what that step is for well you can actually fold this back here and make a trolling seat out of it so when you have your outriggers out and you get your autopilot on and everything you can just come back out here and watch your lines and everything 
really cool and you can easily step here two people can easily sit here just a great seat one of the best seats in the house besides uh, the helm there but it'll easily store away and then down here you got a little bit of storage and this one's equipped with the sea keeper so this is the sea keeper uh, addition then you have a little bit of extra uh, storage here on the side cup holder out of the way very nice to be able to do that and then we'll come over here so you have the sink that will pop up great option there nice little cutting board over here and then that'll actually you know not rattle in anything it's a nice little cut out then you have another battery and a little bit of storage there you'll have your fridge here as well and then this boat is equipped with the air conditioning up here in the cockpit as well as down in the um, the cabin there so your control is up here you'll see that you have a VHF and right now it's blinking because it doesn't have service but we also have vents up here in the windshield you have a nice big um, glass windshield here and you got your windshield wipers and everything like that so you're not going to get wet uh, first of all this is a, a great boat to ride out but like I said there's just more and more options to go over um, kind of one of those boats you got to see in person to believe but look at this this is great you can come sit right here if you wanted to as well as you can flip the seat back again and fold this out and then you have a table here so that's really great if you wanted to be out of the elements and then have a little picnic uh, you'll, you'll be able to push it back down lock it in place but wait there's more so you can actually oh, there we go have two rows of seating so you have your your co-captain's chair here and then you have your row back there so you can easily come up here and just hang out put your hand up here or whichever and feel the breeze come in and then you've got your cup holders and everything like that there so this is equipped with the air conditioning up here so you can close uh off the whole um uh, cockpit area and uh upper area here and have it really nice and uh the ac is really nice in the summer so we'll come here to um the actual uh, helm so you have the Boston Whaler uh, switching it's got the c-zone switching here so you can turn all the lights on and off just by a switch of a button and you can do really a lot of things here but uh, you also be able to control the vessel you have your uh, JL audio and then other switching here they just come in like a little toolbar area but if you just wanted to see you know your charts here you can easily get to that there there's your vents for your AC you got your redundant switches up here so it all makes sense if you really need to get to them you can get it uh, you can just click them up here instead of go through the electronics there uh, your JL control here your binnacle and as well as this has the joystick so the joystick piloting so you've got your sky hook um, your cruise control and then of course you have your autopilot and everything like that you also have uh, your control for your spotlight and your trim tabs and then this is going to be your kill switch lanyard but just seeing how the ergonomics of this boat works, you can see you can flip down this bolster here. Your feet go automatically onto this perfect little ledge that they have for your feet. Pull down your armrests, and then boom, you're ready to go. You can go forwards, backwards, control the steering wheel wherever you want it. And uh, you, you don't have to bend over too far to hit the binnacles. You could go back here, beep, boop, and then control your heading uh, just by... A click or a push of the uh, the joystick there so everything makes sense on the boat of course this will swivel around and everything but just really really nice seat and then if you are you know wanting to run and gun you could stand here your feet have a place to go right there it's just very easy and now I'm leaning the back against the bolster and I could still see over the the windlass and everything like that but we'll go down in the uh, uh, the head here or go down in the cabin and check it out So here we have the nice, very nice table. This will actually go down and then you will have your seats come in here and make a nice V-berth uh, bed. You also have your, um, your TV that will come out and swivel. So anywhere you want to put it, it's really nice to be able to do that. You can put it back away just like your really comfortable seating here. And then if you need more space, you can flip this up. And then if you're coming down here while anybody's running, you still have a, a grab, uh, grab rail here as well. 
And as I mentioned, this will just go flat down here and you can actually pull in the, uh, the cushions here and fill it in. So it's very nice to be able to do that. Very transformable, very, very comfortable. And then you have your, your open skylight here. So even when you're going, you get so much breeze coming in through this boat and you've got very nice, uh, very nice lighting. But like I said, it's a mini sport fish, so you can do anything with this boat. You've got a couple rod holders in here. You can put your rods back there, the tips up here. Very nice. You're not going to hit your head on it. And just be able to do anything that you want with the boat. And then you've got so many different uh, uh, zones and speakers with this boat as well. You've got your JL down here, so you can turn it up or down, down here, as well as in uh, the different zones in the cockpit. And so here... You have a stove because it's got the, uh, the the cruising package. You got your microwave, and then of course another refrigerator there, and then just nice little storage underneath here, and then underneath you have another trash can. So it's very nice to be able to do that. Um, have the storage, nice little rail up here to put a, anything that you want, and then you can undo this. Right. So this boat does have the comfort package where it has all the sheets and the beddings for your mid berth and your V berth there. Nice little light here. You can change it to red or you can change it to white. Uh, very cool. The kids will love it especially. But you got a lot of space down here. Very comfortable. You want some privacy, you can bring this over here. It's on some Velcro Head on this. And first thing you'll notice when you open the door, you got a nice mirror looking at yourself. And you'll be able to step right in. I'm not too tall, but I'm not short myself. But you, you got a lot, of, a lot of different windows and lighting coming in here as well. You'll see that you have the uh, the lighting in here, so at night you may want to put it red so it's not too bright on your eyes. Um, a nice sink, pull out shower, and then it's got a drain in here. Of course, you got your vacuum flush head, and then you also have a, uh, a little hook for like, towels or your bathing suits and stuff. So very cool to be able to do that. Pull that out there, bam, you got a shower. Great, uh, be able to do that. And then of course you can put all your uh, your soaps and stuff here or down in under the sink there. So nice little nice little toilet paper holder there. I'm gonna need that. And so we'll go back up here. We'll just uh, finish the video from up here. You're gonna have to edit some things out here. Ah, you ready? So this is the look at the all new 2023 and available Boston Whaler 325 Conquest. My name is Daniel Frenchus here at Marine Max Orlando. I'd be happy to take you out on the water, catch you some fish as well. Give me a call, 407-590-0493. So this is the look at the all new 2023 and available Boston Whaler 325 Conquest. My name is Daniel Frenchus here at Marine Max Orlando. I'd be happy to take you out on the water, catch you some fish as well. Give me a call, 407-590-0493.